Hi, I'm Steve Randall and I wanted to show you a few things to do with the Raspberry Pi and the Pi in the Sky boards and fitting them inside polystyrene boxes. So I've got three boxes here um, that you'll find we typically use on high altitude ballooning. This one is um, about, a, about uh, 14 centimetres cubed inside, about that's the size of a standard Coke can for reference. Um, it's probably a bit too big for um, most Raspberry Pi um, projects um, and also it's quite thick and if the Raspberry Pi is generating a lot of heat you may well have a, have a heat problem with that, believe it or not. Um, so probably recommend one of these smaller boxes. Um, this is the smallest box. This is actually a Hobbycraft box. It's um, about, I think it's 110 millimetres, so it's, you know, um, something like that, uh, uh, square, and then about 50 millimetres high in, inside. That's just about big enough for one of the newer Raspberry Pis that don't have the USB connector sticking out the side. And you'd also need to use right-angled sockets for that one to fit. So this is a one of the old model A boards with um, the, the older pie in the sky um, and you can see that, that you know when you fit it inside there's not a lot of room left. The the newer boards, new um, the newer Raspberry Pis such as the two and the three are, are actually a bit shorter because they don't have this USB connector sticking out the side um, and with a, a right angled um, RF connectors here it will just about fit inside. So that's that's one box. That um, is just about as small as you can probably go uh, and get the batteries in as well. This box here, this is a a 1.4 litre box, and that one the Raspberry Pi fits sort of quite nicely inside, giving you plenty of room for the connectors giving you plenty of room to put a battery in as well. So this one's probably one of the easier ones to use. The next size up, um, which is a 2.4 litre box, and that, although obviously it fits in, is starting to get you know, a bit too big for the project. So I'd say you probably want, if, you, if you've got nothing else to put inside the box, such as a GoPro or something, if you've got nothing else to go in there, then you probably want to be looking for this sort of size of box. So, and, and this is um, about 10 millimeter thick um, polystyrene, so it, um, it's not too bad for, for heat build up um, and it gives you plenty of protection on landing. Um, and it's you know two two identical parts that sort of slot together. So when you take the top off, you've got plenty. You can get your fingers in to do to do things rather than trying to be through a long deep box. Um, so this is this is probably the one I'd recommend.